Are they holding the Senator's son? Why should we tell you? You're one of the kidnappers. They all are. Your ordeal will soon be over. It's not much of an ordeal. Not compared to how these people are living. You don't blame them for abducting you. What choice do they have? The Senator, he's here. Jedi, arrest these criminals. Our investigation is not yet complete. They abducted my son. I demand his release. We are greatly honored by your visit, Ambassadors. My master will be with you shortly. I have a bad feeling about this. What is it? We dare not go against the Jedi. The Chancellor should never have brought them into this. Kill them immediately. Uh -oh. <laughs> Usha cannot be here. A droid army is about to attack the Naboo. We should no care about the Naboo. And speed is on our way. We are gonna speed Usha away. We could use a transport. We shall give Usha on the bongo. What is to become of Jar Jar Binks here? He seems to be punished. Your gods demand his life belongs to me now. Be gone with him! Count me out of this one. Who did I know? Yeah! I need parts for a J Type 327 Nubian. Uh, we have lots of that. We'll find the one you need. <laughs> Be in luck. I'm the only one here about to has one. How's he gonna pay for all of this? 20,000 Republic Dactaris. Republic credits are no good out here. Credits will do fine. No, they won't. Credits will do fine. My tricks gonna work on me. Only money. We're on our way to Coruscant on a very important mission. I can help. I can fix anything. There's big race tomorrow on Boonta Eve. You could enter my pod. What do won't let you? You could make him think it was yours and get him to let me pilot it for you. Remember, concentrate on the moment. Use your instincts. One of the craziest moments that everyone seems to overlook in Star Wars is the fact that Qui-Gon Jinn happily entered a nine-year-old boy into one of the most dangerous pod races on the planet. The race literally had a 33% survival rate with 12 out of 18 racers dying, and had Anakin himself been killed, Qui-Gon would have easily found himself facing a manslaughter charge. We'll handle this. Han Solo, I'm Captain of the Millennium Falcon. Must have gone wrong. I was in the middle of the exchange. I'm handing over the coaxium. I ran away. Then I boosted their speeder. You held onto one of the files. Well, what happened? They double crossed you and tried to kill me. And my coaxium. They kept that too, but we learned a very valuable lesson. My friend! Next time! I hit him back. The freaking cage. Stop it. This is a secure area. You must have proper clearance. Don't have a boarding pass. Giafino. 
Next. ID chips. Funny thing, we don't have them. We have this. Refined hyperfuel. Let us through, it's all yours. Not so fast, kid! in this game. So this is uh, Sabak? Captain Lindo Karazin. Did you win your ship playing cards? What are you flying? VCX 100. Mm. That is a quality ship, right boys? I mean, I'm sure yours is very nice. My ship. Against your ship. In this scene, Han Solo pretends to own a valuable starship in order to raise the stakes at a gambling table and convince other players to put more valuables on the line. This would obviously be very illegal, but since the game winner ended up using illegal tactics himself to cheat Han, we can drop charges on this one. L3, do you mind? I can feel you looking at me. What are we doing here? This is a precision job, thermal vault, will be on the lowest level. Only way we're gonna pull this off if everybody plays their part. Stick to the plan. Do not improvise. That's what I said! <laughs> Grab that coaxium, put it in the case. Big stuff, you're coming with me. Now I'm gonna tell you the most important. I have a smart move, kid. I would have killed you. 
that boot has fallen? Tell Jabba that I've got his money. Song Pichale. Jabba wa ninchi ko baburishani as inyawi kuchunso. Over my dead body. Uhle nyuma. Ches po kutu ta krista krenko. I've been waiting for you. You didn't think I was gonna run, did you? Look, Java, even I get boarded sometimes. Think I had a choice? Chewie here tells me you're looking for passage to the Alderaan system. What's the cargo? Only passengers and no questions asked. We'd like to avoid any imperial entanglements. Well, that's the real trick, isn't it? And it's gonna cost you something extra. Stop that ship! <laughs> Boy, it's lucky you had these compartments. Oh, I knew that you were gonna say that. Number 111, number 111. The scanners pick up anything, report it immediately. Hey down there! Did you give us a hand with this? I'm afraid I'm not quite sure, sir. He says I found her and keeps repeating she's here. Princess Leia. Level 5, detention block AA-23. I'm afraid she's scheduled to be terminated. At this point, Han and Luke find out that the Empire is attempting to execute Princess Leia, which would be illegal since she was not given a trial. So any of their actions taken to save her would be classed as self-defense. Hello there. Try, Master. Why do I get the feeling you're going to be the death of me? I am trying. Can you see him? I think he is a she. Go and find her. Where are you going, Master? For a drink. You want to buy some death sticks? You don't want to sell me death sticks. You want to go home and rethink your life. I want to go home and rethink my life. Cody, battle positions. If Rex and I can engage them here, you two might have a chance to get through their lines undetected. Move your troops back to the heavy cannons. I'll delay the droids. I surrender. I've conceded the battle. Now we simply have to negotiate the terms of surrender. You are stalling. Nonsense. Uh oh. Oh well.
We know you've taken at least two children. Where are they? What are you going to do, Jedi? Torture me? This conversation is over. Using the Force to compel a strong mind is... risky. There is a danger that his mind could be destroyed. You, you will, will take, take us, us to the Holocron. The holocron. You, you will, will take, take us, us to the Holocron. Now! No! Get out of my head! Separatist takeover complete! Another Republic planet has fallen! Onderon has seceded under the rule of a new king! The only way to reclaim Onderon will be through armed struggle. We lack sufficient hardware and supplies. That sounds like terrorism, Anakin. We must not train terrorists. We're gonna show you how to target and destroy them. You have to take out both chambers. Destroyers are quick, but they do have two weaknesses. You're ready now. We are going to take the fight to the droids. How many other Jedi have managed to survive? Heard from no one, have we? Have we had any contact from the temple? Received a coded retreat message, we have. It requests all Jedi to return to the temple. Well, then we must go back. If there are any stragglers, they will fall into the trap and be killed. There is too much at stake. I agree. Obviously, although Obi-Wan and Yoda started this fight with the clones, it was done in defense of the remaining Jedi as they would have also been killed at the temple had Obi-Wan not deactivated the fake message. There's no danger. The fighting's over. And this is personal. This is something I must do myself. Oh, dear. Anakin. Let her go, Anakin! If you're not with me, then you're my enemy. Don't try it! All right, they're on their way. I'm looking for a Jedi. I am Haja Estri. I help all who are in need. In return, I ask only a few credits. What do you know of the Force? Just that there's a lot of remotes. You're gonna help me find this girl I'm looking for. Yeah, I'll do it. If it's the sewers you want, there's only one place to go. But you'll never get it. Now, apart from robbing this scientist who was just an innocent civilian, everything Obi-Wan does from here is self-defense, as he rescues a kidnapped Leia and then helps her escape while being chased across the galaxy.